Okay, welcome to day four of our crochet along. And hopefully you've been moving along very nicely and are almost done, if not done, with your first round of the border. I am just about completed my, with mine and I just have to finish a couple more areas here. And if you take a look, let me come back to the single crochet in between those squares. So I'm going to do a single crochet in the space between two squares. And then like you've been doing all the way along, chain three. And this is just finishing up the first border round. Single crochet in between the squares, chain three. single crochet between the two squares and now we are at the last square approaching the final corner so I'll do chain three and then you'll remember that we started with two single crochets in the corner of that last square so we need to have three so in that same opening where the first two cro single crochets were we do our one single crochet and then slip stitch to the first single crochet. And there we have the end of the first border round. Now for today, you will have gotten your directions in your email today for the second border round. And now this one gives a little bit of width to the border. And you'll remember that in the directions from last week, the very last thing said, after you get to this point, chain two. And this is going to just fill in some space here. But then now the beginning of our directions say, work two double crochets in the corner stitch. So we're going to do a double crochet and then a second double crochet. And you'll find that we've got the two double crochets plus the two, or excuse me, the two chains and then the two double crochets. That's fine. At the end, we're actually going to add the third double crochet. But this is right the way you start out with this one. Now, to do this border in the the chain three space that we, we created in our first border round, we're going to do just in the space three double crochets. So there's one, and again, we're doing it just in the space, not into any particular stitch. Second double crochet, and the third double crochet. Okay. Now we find our single crochet that we made in between the two squares and in that single crochet we do one double crochet right in the top of the single crochet and that's what it looks like so far. Now we keep repeating. In the space made by the chain three we do three double crochets, two, and three. Okay, get some more yarn for myself here. Then double crochet in the top of that single crochet from the previous round. You can see how we're filling in and making that whole border wider and we just keep repeating. Now in that space created by the three chains we do three double crochets. Two and three. And in the single crochet, double crochet. And this is what we're going to do all the way until we get 
to the corner. Okay, so I'll do a few more here. Three, we're in that chain three space. Now we do one double crochet in the single crochet. Three double crochet in the chain three space. And then one double crochet in the single crochet. And you can see how pretty that is. It's getting to have that wide border that we that we see in the finished product. So again, I'll do one more section. Here's the three double crochets in the three chain space. There's two and three and then a double crochet in the single crochet. So as you look at this, it should look pretty even and pretty no big spaces in between because you've put three and then one, three and then one, and you just continue to do that all the way. So I'll let you work on that and I'll be back when we get to the, the next corner. Okay, so now I have worked my way all along of the side one and I am just about ready to get to the corner. So what I'm going to do, I'm just at the point where I need to put three double crochets into the chain three space. So I'll do that. One, two, and three, and then double crochet into this last single crochet. And then I have one more chain three space before the corner. So I'll do three double crochets there, two, and three. And then in the middle of these single crochets from the previous round, in the middle chain, I'm going to do three double crochets. One, two, and three. Okay. And then I'm going to start moving down side two. So here we're going to do three double crochets in the chain three space. And you can see we've made the, the turn at the corner. Now we're going to do a double crochet in the single crochet from the previous round. And just like we did side one, three double crochets in the chain three space. And we'll just keep repeating this whole procedure all the way along. Pull that out. All the way along our second side do the next corner, third side, do the next corner, final side, and then do a, one more double crochet in that corner that we started out with. But there you can see how it goes. I think you'll be able to do it. And for next time, I'd like to have you do the entire second round of the border. Have fun. Bye.